Well, you're bleeding well here, which is a good sign. I think if we can get the oxygen tank here and then have you do it a couple times a week, this will heal in like no time. Okay, hi Richard. How are you doing? How are you doing today? Pretty good. Yeah, we got this uh, ulcer here. We're going to clean up all of this. Also got the, these um, orthotics. You see the pressure point right here. We're going to accommodate that to take pressure off that area. Also going to start him back on the hyperbaric oxygen treatment, which uh, we have the machine, but uh, it's at the shop right now getting fixed. Sorry, Richard. <laughs> so we're gonna get it back next next week or two, and then once we do that, then I'm gonna have you be on the um, oxygen tank, which really helps to close this down. Before we started filming, Richard was telling me about his new diet plan. Right? You've been fasting for 12 hours. Yes. Yeah. That's called intermittent fasting. Yeah, but, yeah. I'm taking half of. Uh, that's something I used, I used to take. Yeah, you're doing great, huh? Yeah. So does it go too low? Sometimes when you fast, uh, when you yeah. take the medicine, it can go too low. Yeah, yeah. But I have the, the Dexcom. Uh-huh. So oh, you're measuring... I'm, I'm constantly looking at it. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And, yeah, that makes a world of difference. Right, right. So you know where you are all the time, huh? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. How often do you have to replace that little thing? You have to put a new I, battery in there? No, it's a it's a sensor. There's there's one that lasts the transmitter lasts three months. Oh, three months. Okay. The sensor lasts ten days. Oh, I see. So every ten days, I'm, I'm changing the sensor, but I'm putting the tran same transmission in there until uh -huh. the three months are over. Uh huh. But uh. Who changed the sensor? You do? Yeah. It's oh. Really easy. It's really easy. Oh, okay. Okay. But it it, it must have a battery in there too. I have a charger. Oh, charge! Oh, you charge it? Oh, I, uh, this is from, I don't know if you, you want to get a picture of that. If you click the button, it'll tell you what it is right now. Mm -hmm. Oh, I see. What is it? It's uh, 168. Yeah. Is that the 168? Yeah. Wow, it shows you everything, huh? Yeah. And it wow. It gives you the pattern. Uh-huh. If you see the dots. Right, right, right. I see the... Head and going on, so you know exactly where you are. Yeah. So how how's that how's that fasting going? Like so, what what hours do you fast? Like what well, from what time to what time do you fast? I don't do it on a regular basis. Uh -huh. On the I mean I, I fast I try to fast on a regular basis. Uh -huh. But uh, the, I get up at different times. Sometimes I get up you know early. Sometimes I get up late. It depends on the time I get up. Oh, I see. From the time you get up, you fast until. No. Fast for twelve hours? No, right. I eat. I eat. Uh -huh. I eat. I drink a protein shake. Uh -huh. Or lately, I've been drinking nothing but protein shakes because I have no appetite. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah. But, uh, Sorry. I get a. I. Let's say if I if I start at ten, and uh -huh. then I'll quit eating. I'll quit drinking seven, uh -huh. and then twelve hours after that, uh -huh. I won't. Uh, Drink nothing. I mean, I drink water. I drink water, but I won't try not to eat nothing. Mm -hmm. But my sugars came down a lot, yeah, huh? Yeah. Then the answer I'm like, I'm taking some days. I'm, I'm only taking like 15 units a day. Uh huh. You used to take how much? I used to take like like 90. I used to take like 30. Oh 30 really? At, 30 at lunch. 30 at 30 at breakfast. 30 at lunch. Uh -huh. You know, no, 20. Let's say 20. Uh huh. You know, my sugars are, are in, sometimes uh, they'll get to three, so I'll take 20 units. Uh-huh. Um, so you just take the insulin at night time now? After, after you eat dinner? Or? You know, I take a, I take the Novolog uh -huh. for uh, breakfast, breakfast and dinner. I uh -huh. really, I really, uh, I'm only eating twice a day, uh -huh. actually. Uh-huh. So you're fasting for almost 12 hours? Yes. Oh, okay. That's what I do every day. It's called intermittent fasting. Mm -hmm. I wish I could do longer, but that's the maximum I could do because I get so hungry. <laughs> so you get, but you're not getting hungry right now. No, I'm not. Uh, getting, have no appetite. Anymore. Yeah, you have to go see a doctor about that. Okay. Yeah, my, uh, my throat. Throat's hurting, huh? Hurting, yeah, to swallow. Yeah. Well, you're bleeding well here, which is a good sign. I think if we can get the oxygen tank here 
and then have you do it a couple times a week, this will heal in like no time. So I'd like to follow up with you and make sure this all closes up uh, as soon as we get the oxygen tanks, okay? Because you're, you're bleeding well, see? So, so that, you, you that, opened the wound again? Yeah, well it was open, but I cleaned it out, cleaned all the bad stuff out. Mm -hmm. So once we take the pressure off this area, which is what I'm going to do on this support right here, I'm going to put pads here to take pressure off of it. And then uh, I think with that combination with the, your, um, the oxygen tank, I think it will heal really quickly, okay? Because, is that coconut oil that you put in there? Oh no, that's silvadine, silvadine, it's called mm -hmm. silvadine. It's like a coconut oil on there. Oh, you do? Yeah. Okay. Does that seem to help? Uh, you mean yeah. in the in the wound? Yeah. I just get some coconut oil on it. And, and then put it on around there. Yeah. Okay. Sometimes honey, honey really tends to help quite a bit as well. Okay. So I put a couple of pads in there to take pressure off of it, so you don't have to put it here. Okay. Okay. Then I'm gonna put a little bit of uh, gauze here because you're bleeding. I don't want you to bleed all over the place, okay? So I'm going to put just a thin layer of the, the gauze a little bit right there. I don't want to make it too thick though, but I'm going to put a little layer around it so that you don't have the... Like that, okay? And bleeding should stop right away. Okay? okay. But you're doing a great job with uh, intermittent fasting. I think you'd be, you'd do really well as far as your, your plus sugar is concerned. Yeah. Okay. And then you need to go back to your doctor about your throat problem. Okay. Because I woke up this morning and it was, my sugar was 77. Oh, okay. And I drank the, uh, my sugar shake. Uh huh. And I'm taking the insulin. So oh, okay. right now, 174. I, have, I have the insulin with me right now. Uh -huh. If it goes over like in the 90s, uh -huh. I'll take like four or five units. Oh, I see. Okay. But you're doing great. Okay. Thank you, Richard. Hopefully okay. we heal this right away. Okay. Yeah, thank you. Okay.